Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of One Step from Eden, where my heart broke on the end of the last episode. And then I I guess I forgot to show you guys the unlock. I just wanted to end the episode on a bit of comedy and a bit of drama. But I forgot about unlocks. We leveled up, but I don't think the level up had anything to do with this unlock because we unlocked the shopkeeper just as we killed her. Buying her way into Eden, whether they like it or not. We've also unlocked Thorn, gained five spell power, but shield decays slowly. And Dart Frog, apply four poison when a spell hits an enemy. Dude! Jero, Jero. That's really cool. It's too bad that those orange ones show up so rarely. Anyway, we did unlock the shopkeeper in spite of how it looked in the previous episode. We got the kill, but we didn't get to relish it. And that's pro possibly like, look at how red her eyes are. She's an evil, sadistic woman. She crazy. Like the rest of them, they look pretty chill. They look pretty, well, I mean, she, she doesn't look crazy as much as she looks intense. He looks pretty intense, but kind of one note. It's like, he's like the Sasuke of the group. Um, determined, carefree. Her? That's straight up sadism. She's evil. She's super evil. Don't let, don't let the looks fool you. All right, we have hired gun. We have bow snipe. Counter strike, one of my favorite abilities. And swipe. I also like swipe quite a bit. She starts with beret, drop money when you take damage. Your max HP equals your money. And her weapon throws money at enemy enemies, bounces off target. Well, this is gonna be really interesting. Let's give her a shot. I don't know how well we're gonna do, but here we go. We start with 400 money, which means we have 400 health. Let's see how the shot works. Okay. Dude, 250 damage, that's crazy. She's so innocent the way she moves around. Uh, is there no shopkeeper when you're the shopkeeper? Let's see, this is a tough choice. I like these both quite a bit. Especially if I have a small deck, Riffle can be quite a quite a bonus. You know what? Let's go with the Hit Seeker. I think it's going to be more damage overall. And we're going to skip all of this. I'm not sure how to build her yet. I'm not sure really what I want with her. Uh, there doesn't seem to be a shop down here. Oh, it costs four mana to use that. Which makes it dangerous. It's also, it's like the, um... Oh, dead. It's like, uh, it's like Shiso's gun. I really like Anubis. I like Anubis quite a bit. I don't know what I want to do, though. If she doesn't start with anything, she could basically be anybody. Wait a minute. I can just buy stuff from myself? Wait a minute. Wait, what? I could just... I can shop whenever I want. Wish I had a bigger shop. Make money, ma make money, money, make money. I sell to live and live to sell. I sell to live. Does she say anything else? It's just those two over and over again, I guess. Uh, I can buy these for free. But I have to refresh my own stock, and that actually is quite a bit of money. Wait, I can just have these. I'll, I, actually, I'll keep this one. <laughs> I'll replace this later. Yeah, I'll just take them all. And I could buy more. That's very interesting. It's very, very interesting. 
Fire shot, lose two money if this kills an enemy gain four money. That's actually a lot of damage, so we should keep that around. I don't know what to do here. Um, this applies fragile, which could be pretty good. Hold on, let's look at this again. It applies fragile on the first one, then hits the second one with more damage, so it winds up being 150 damage for two, but it's also area of effect, which is pretty solid. I think we're gonna go ahead and grab it for a nice bursty damagey burst boy. And then we'll get more mana regen, and then just like, I guess we can try and make a build where we unload on people. Oh, lost my money. Okay, we don't lose money for getting hurt, which is a good distinction. Sequencer is very interesting. Oh, she's casting it three times. These demos are kind of lame. They're not lame. They're really nice to see, but I wish it wouldn't cast it so many times in quick succession because it gives the wrong idea of the attack. Uh, I'm passing on all of these, by the way. Surprise, surprise. Clown's passing on something that's very good. Look, I don't know which of those are good. Why don't you tell me? Why don't you help me out a little bit? We're gonna go with the treasure chest. Screw the hazards. Um, I need to save my money, save money, save money. So we can do that. Look at the damage that can do. And that will get us money. A little bit of money. Not much, but enough money. I think shields... Ooh, rain down thunder strikes. Six times four, so it does six of them four times. What is our mana regeneration at? 0.8 per second. The shopkeeper is more interested in killing people, I think. Possibly the hardest character in the game because you start with such low maximum health. But you have a very interesting mechanic in be able to being able to refresh your own stock, buy out all of the artifacts, buy out like the cards that are in here if there's things that you like and being able to shop literally whenever you want lose two max mana heal 150 like this is all interesting stuff this is a really cool character i really like her i'm gonna go with the shields starts battles with full mana that's kind of what i want now, if I can get a max mana gem at some point, I'll be sitting pretty. Okay. Nice, got it. I was beginning to worry. Wasn't sure if I was going to be able to do it. Booster shot, air slash. No sorry, Bob, to all of those. Nice. That was super worthwhile. Stim pack. <laughs> Lose 300 max HP. Hold up. Your max HP equals your money versus stim pack. How does this interact? It says lose 300 max HP. But this is a hard equals. Do I risk it? Let's risk it. It's early enough. It's early enough that we can give it a try. Okay. So our max HP has not changed. But it did do 300 damage. Which, in and of itself, is very frightening. I can heal myself, but at what cost? <laughs> okay. 
Okay, that was a bad shot. Oh, what a dodge, lady. Okay. Oh, this is a bad spot. Okay, I would have had time to move. Oh, careful. Nice, dude. Destroyed her. Um, am I just playing around with you? Um, hmm. Yes. I need your money. I'm sorry. It's nothing personal, kid. Health potion. Gain five money after every battle. Are you kidding me? Yes. Yes. Why do you? Why even ask? Why? Why even ask? So here's here's a question. Here's a good question for you. Since my health is really low right now, I think refreshing the stock is a good idea. Stop time for five seconds when you go below 200 HP. Lose four defense. I don't think so. Shield decays quickly. Gain 25 money. For two battles, I think I can take that. Uh, this is interesting stuff. So I can gain five luck, but I take four, uh, 140 damage, which you might think, hey, why would you do that? It's a bad idea. But look, I gain all this money. I gain all this money back, but I can gain this health back with this med kit, and then I can get Cassidy's Scarf. Double Edge is not going anywhere near my deck. Uh, you don't want double edges near your deck at all. It's a, it's a recipe for disaster. Now, as for these... Ember, I think, because it's free, let's go for it. That was a bit goofy what we've done. Don't use the bow. Dodge everything. Kill her with the kunai. Get your heals and then move on. We're pretty much at max health. Heals, okay. All right, now we're looking good. 384, we're almost back to the max mana that we had before. Um. Skipping all of it. We have a bit of a triage situation. We lost that max health, but we gained it back in spades. Maybe not spades. All right. All right, doing good. Up to 399. Gain 20 shield when you shuffle. That's exactly what I need. All right. Things are starting to look super, super cool right now. Dash forward and hit enemies in front. Honestly, I like it. I like it. I like it for what we're going with. Restore many when you cast a spell. Oh, apply fragile to enemies at the start of the battle. Uh, as much as I like mana vein, um, and as much as I want mana vein, I think this is the better solution. It's 150 to refresh stock now. So it's not going to happen anytime soon. Oh my god. Flawless battle, dude. Free, free, not so free. Yeah, we don't want any of that. So what are we looking for on this character? I think a few more high damage spells is gonna are, are going to do us very, very good. Ooh. Okay, the Ember actually did damage. Ow. Okay, our max health is looking pretty good now. And by max health, I mean gain 10 to 40 money. Do I really want that right now? 
I mean, I know it turns into max health, but starting... Okay, 20 poison damage isn't really going to amount to much whenever I don't have anything else to capitalize. It's 30 damage to everything in the battle. Sorry, 37, roughly. Treasure chest. Okay. Good stuff. Nice. Now, if I could find something to heal me after all of this, I think we'll be in a really, really good position. I don't have enough expensive stuff to make switch bait worthwhile. Roots not going to be worthwhile either. Honestly, I think the basic attack for this character is just like an emergency situation. It's not something you ever want to feel pressure to use. Oh, what a dodge. Small chance to gain 999. Or to hit for 999. Shot applies 100 poison. No. No. No, no, no. We're not a poison deck. As much as I would love to build a poison deck, that is not us. Hold on, I have kunai synergy, right? Kunai is when you shuffle... Kunai is apply fragile, right? Yeah, so acupuncture. We have a lot of fragile synergies. But honestly, for the calamity spells, I think I want to prep for that. Just in case, you know, something pops up to give us something sweet. I love the music of this fight. Oh, what a miss. I ran into that. Okay, don't move. Ooh, this needs to go. Careful. Oh, there's another one? Oh, you ran away. Oh, you dodged it. What a hero. I think she walked into my shot because she was feeling sorry for me. You can't just kill yourself, lady. That means I gotta kill you. Gotta acquiesce with your desires. I like mine. Gain 10 shield whenever tile's broken. 2 shield when you get hit. Don't like it. Honestly, 2 shield when you get hit is just a worse version of the t-shirt. Because the t-shirt gives you two defense. Defense just straight up, I think, is one-to-one -one damage removal. So you get hit for ten, you now take eight. But this, it's... After the fact, after you take the ten damage, you then gain two shield, which can then be lost on shuffle. Which is no good. Ten shield whenever a tile is broken. It's quite a bit more circumstantial, but I think there's enough that breaks tiles to make it worthwhile, especially if we go and fight Terra. Which I think if we go to the ruins, that might be who we fight. No, it's going to be Reva. Whoa! That's right. Fragile and 250 damage and a combination is a pretty solid situation. Oh yeah, and flame damage gets us 0.2 mana. Uh, Firewall, I honestly very much like. It's a very solid spell. It's a good option in many situations. Nice. Itself for 40 damage and gain 100 shield. 
deals the damage on the shield if you have shield already. <clears throat> yeah, let's grab Anubis. It's a delayed, like, 60, 70, nearly 80 damage. Full health. More or less. Summons a monument. I don't like this one so much. Damage everyone for double their poison. Remove their poison. Nope. Not enough poison to make that work. All I have is Anubis. I don't even have the poison vial. I uh, passed that up. Get that out of here. Why did I put that there? Because I knew that's where it was going to be needed. How did I know? It's because I'm just a brilliant person. Perth brilliant person. I'm just a real. I'm just a brilliant person. Duct tape. Obviously. <clears throat> we need more money and more, more and more and more and more and more money. Man of Ain. Honestly, I don't think we need it with all the flame damage that we're doing. But this is pretty cool. How did that actually work? I'm so confused at how that stuff works. I think stuff that has consume and... No. I think stuff that has consume and give five more max health, I don't think that would actually give me max health because of the way the beret works. It would probably heal us for five, but I don't think it would give us any max health. We're going to skip this. Oh great, my favorite. Oh, what a miss. Whoa. Okay, good stuff. Whoa, the fire just straight up kills him. It goes through the, the shields. <gasps> Blessing of Susano! And it's upgraded, bonus 20 damage. Oh, and Incline has minus one mana on it. Dude, the Blessing of Susano. Oh, I love it so much. Here's our Blessing. doing. Ooh, you're dodging these shots like a mad woman. Ooh. Oh, okay. Yep. Completely have forgotten how those work. It's okay. Ooh, that was really bad. Okay, it wasn't really bad. We didn't really lose that much. Here, sniper shot to get rid of her. Wait for, for wait for what? Wait for nothing. Self-defense turret? You know, I don't have it, anything that's wild enough to make this detrimental to me. The amount of damage that that thing ends up doing. Reduce shuffle time by one second. 
or an upgrade. I don't like the pet turtle that much. It's a good wall. It's a good shield wall. Don't get me wrong, but if the turtle's getting hit, the sound cues that go off confuse me, and I'm not able to catch things in time. So let's let's check this. Is this going to be Terra? It is Terra. So I think we decide which enemies we would like to fight. Well, that was not great. Blessing of Susano! <laughs> Alright, our max health is starting to look very, very nice. Twinferno is cool. Don't much care for it. PK Fire. Yes. I almost said no, but yes. This way. <laughs> Chaos Fragment. Gain a random effect at the start of battle. Hold on, did that say Fragile on it? Yeah, Fragile, Poison, Haste, Shield, Mana Regen. Oh, it's, it could start with... Okay, poison would suck. Ice flow is not great. Guillotine. No. <sighs> I think. No. Zigzag. I'll take zigzag since it restores half mana cost. I think that's gonna make it a little worthwhile to have clogging up the deck. Susano, let's go. Dude. With my mana regen, it's over before it even begins. Oh, one XP. How could you? Dude, my, like, calculation brain is not working right now. I don't know why that was so hard for me. Warp rays? Under R. No, these aren't good. One more max mana. Defense also reduces shield damage. Do I have any defense? I do not. Wait, do I have a halo on? What's with the... Like, you see this? Was that always there? Hmm. Very interesting. We do not need the campfire right now. Uh. Oh god. Duh. That sucks, dude. I had a way to kill it, but I put the self-defense turret just in the right spot for me to not be able to capitalize. Because the fire would have hit it and it would have done a million damage to me. And that just would be a situation that none of us wants to see. Alright, we're... Deal 20 damage to a random enemy when you consume a card. It's kind of nice. I'm not consuming... Oh, I'm consuming kunais. Kunais and my uh, my potion. I, also, I think the self-defense turret consumes. I You know, I can look directly in the deck. Susano consumes, too. So we have a decent amount of consummation going on in here. God diggity.
Where are you going, lady? Ooh, that wasn't good. Ah! Oh. Oh! I have so much incidental damage. <laughs> Blood shield's cool, but I don't know if it's cool enough. Same with the collect ring. The kunai's at the end. Hmm. Could be cool, but again, not quite cool enough. Restore one mana if idle for one second. Applying poison deals five damage. Let's do that. Oh my god. I'm gonna be fighting Celacy sometime in the future. I'm taking damage! I'm taking a lot of damage, dude. Come on, man. You're better than this. That was a really poor battle. Is this how this fight's gonna go now? Oh, sweet. What is it? What happens when I consume? I deal 20 damage for free? Sure. My mana generation, I think, is high enough for this to be worthwhile. Take Forte as well. Okay, we're down about a hundred health. That's not where that needed to be. Oh, I think I messed up. Okay. Dude, putting that in front of the stationary tower was a really bad move on my part. Now I wish I had grabbed hardened shields. Credit card? Yes. Because we're heartless, we kill the bunny. All right, we're at full health. Not sure for how long though. Do the damage. Okay. All right, Gunner is up next. Frostbolt bolt for tin shield. Realistically, that's something we could just fire off.
I know how to deal with that now. Oh my god, are you serious? Took that hit. Galaxy Brain plays. Stick stuff on the back row that he can't dodge. Alright, you're done. It's definitely over. I'm a super nice woman. <laughs> Cast the spell on the other slot and consume it? I don't think so, bucko. Tsunami's pretty nice-ish. But I don't know if it's that nice. Neither is Ice Needle. What we have is really nice. Grip Tape? I don't think so. Haste for two seconds when you cast a spell. <gasps> I don't know. I don't really have that much problem moving. I'll probably come to regret that statement later. So, what do we want to upgrade? Dude, Magic Claw is sick. 20 splash damage. Actually, as tempting as that is, no. 25% chance to hit twice. Actually, that's sick. That's That just makes it sicker. Sicker. So, the thing about refreshing stock when you get lower on health is I'm not losing enough health to make refreshing stock feel like a tempting opportunity. Something that does scare me, though, is that we still have Hazel, and you know how Hazel kind of messes me up in the later segments of the game? Let's get Celacy out of the way, dude. Dude, that was super lucky. <laughs> Minefield. Apply Fragile on hit? It's a Fragile Field, not a Minefield. Yeah, <laughs> got him. There's two treasure chests in here. That's interesting. Ooh, we did it without popping open those, uh, tanks. 20% splash damage. Nope, skip them. This character is a lot more sick than I expected it to be. Oh, I missed my heal. Spirit Sword? Hit five tiles in front of you for a short duration. You can move with it, right? Consume, heal, and gain five max HP. It doesn't it doesn't anchor. It doesn't seem like it's a mutually exclusive ability. Okay, make your shot, dude. There's just something about this deck. 
If Trinity is full, gain shield equal to damage of spell in other slot. Gain one Trinity. Restore half. That's so weird. Shine? Oh! Oh, add one jam to the deck? Dude, that's so much damage. You know what? I don't think adding a jam to the deck is really bad enough. For the amount of damage potential that it has. Plus one max mana. Defense also reduces shield damage. Let's go. Our health's almost full. <laughs> okay. Now it is full. Uh, lose one max mana, gain 0.3 mana regen. Honestly? Sure. Jam slam? No. 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 But they were all very tempting. Ho! Oh. Sick. I don't know if I'm going to grab anything for the rest of my life. It's, uh... It's like, it's hard to justify anything right now. I put that on my side of the field. Ah! Yeah. Yeah, be scared. Oh, a jam. Oh god. Oh my god, the damage, dude. This is such a chaos magnet! I'm hitting absolutely no shots. Okay, that's not true, because I literally just hit something as I said that. God, the damage that I took. Whew. I got an achievement, Cold Dead Hands. I think that was my first achievement of this kind, defeat tier four of anybody. It so often ends up being Celacy that I end up fighting. You die, lady. Oh boy. Laser pointer, double edge. I don't want double edge. Laser pointer, I think, is going to be kind of worthwhile. Now we get to move on to lava, and I believe this is where uh, Hazel's going to be. Nope, saffron. Nice. Now let's just see if I can get to a point where... Northwind? Remove their shield, add jam to your deck. This is a high damage ability. Shield beam. That gets me 40 shield. Okay. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna bother quite yet. With the, uh, I'm not gonna bother quite yet with lowering my max health for a refresh. It might be worth it, but it also might not be. You know what? That's good. 
It's like a lo it's like win win. If I miss, I win. If I hit, I still win. Okay, you die. Okay. We're gaining health as we move forward. Rest. No, Sarah Cannon. Deals damage equal to your current money? Are you kidding me? Double cast plus mana cost. It doesn't take my money. It deals damage equal to my money. Right now, that is 1300 health. Or 1300 damage. Yes, more mana regen. Dude, this is sick. This. Whoops. No north wind. Okay, Susano's good here. It'll kill that. What? Ah, sorry, lady. Ugh. <laughs> We're healing so much in every fight. I don't know how much we gained, but it was worth it. Die, Wabbit. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> you just got damage. Now imagine. Imagine if they had Fragile on them. Okay, let's do this fight. Oh, I had no idea where that was going to be. Whew. Don't you freaking dare. Why did I put that on their side? That could have gone a lot better. Carpet bomb. Wildfire, I think I like. All right. So now we're at a point where we can make a choice. 150, which is less... Okay, we're missing 226, which is... Which 150 is less than 226, so it's a no-brainer to do that, which means we can do this. Grab Power Shard, add two kunais to your deck. Nah. Huh. And honestly, it's going to be worth spending that to get us close to max health. And then perhaps Firewall or Forte. No, Firewall, I believe, is what we want to upgrade because Firewall is one of our favorite abilities. Applies Fragile on hit. That is a god tier synergy, if I do say so myself. I know we have a removal that we could possibly use, but I don't feel comfortable using it. Oops. Oh my god, carpet bombing me? How dare you? Oops, what a miss. Susano! Oh. Alright, we'll put that there. Okay, look, I know you had an extra life, but the amount of damage, look, that was sick. Gotcha. It ends here. Eternity Cannon fires a shot every second. On flow, duplicate the spell. Consume. Gain two flow. Oh, this lasts forever? 
And it gains 40 damage. As much as I like the idea of it, I don't think it's worth it. All enemies start with one frost. No, fragile increases damage by 200% instead of 150%. If that if that works on me too, then you know, so be it. It's fine. All right, this is definitely going to be Hazel. No, Pachiso. Have we already fought Hazel? Whoa. Whoops. That was a little rough. Okay, luckily that doesn't hit me. Uh, step pierce? Removes shield from targets. Restore half mana cost, slashes times three. 40% damage, though. Uh, we're going against Shiso. He doesn't have much in the way of shields. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Onward and forwards, my friends. Unbelievable. <laughs> The fact that I started create a flame when a hit deals 100 or more damage. I have so much high damage stuff, dude. Flamberg's not good enough. It's really cool, but I don't think it's going to be worthwhile. We're at close to max health again. All right, she's already dead. What? Why didn't that hit? Just die. Deal damage equal to my money? That means instant death if you didn't catch the memo. Let's get. We have so much insane synergy in this deck. Deal five damage to all enemies when you cast a spell. Are you kidding me? Too good to pass up. Not even close. We're not even doing frost damage. That's what you give me? Alright, this is gonna get us to full. Uh, Bunny dies for your crimes. How are you alive? I can't believe that money shot fires twice. Hold on. Does it really fire twice? Where is it? Double cast! How did I miss that the first time? That means it deals nearly 3,000 damage. That is insane. That's like, that's the god card that you always want on the shopkeeper. And possibly also, um, Shiso. Just because they work very similarly. Holy crap. None of this is any good. Innervate could be okay. It's just one jam for some max mana. But I'm just like throwing spells out left and right. Adding another jam, not super worthwhile, just for the consume effect. No. Get it out of here. Yeet it. Yeet it into the stratosphere. Oh, that was tricky. Dude. That sucked. Wah. Nice north wind. Oh my god. Uh, 
Uh, honestly, that was worth it. Also worth it. Not worth it. I didn't think he would do it again. She's so you're so much easier than Silicy. Easier? I can't do anything now. Wait. <laughs> the static did it. Infinity beam? Fire a laser until you move. Nah. It's cool, but nah. All right. 50% chance to create a frost explosion when frost damage is dealt. Restore 0.1 mana when you cast a spell. That's good for our spell yeeting tendencies. Um, we did not lose much health in that fight. This is going to the final area. Shopkeeper? Honestly, super OP. What? Oh my god. That looked bad. But it wasn't? Like as much damage as I thought I took, that was actually pretty smooth. Must be in battle. Yeah, we'll go this way. Alright, you killed her. Alright, we're still gaining health as we move forward. I don't think we're gonna have to worry about anything as we go through here. We're up to level 12, the highest we've ever been. We're the furthest we've ever been. Gain one mana when you get hit. We'll do the mana vein. Uh, I think the panther thing would have been better, honestly. And sincerely. Okay. Pandemic, no. Breakout. I don't understand. Oh, never mind. I was about to say, I don't understand the minus 10 damage on hit, but. I remember now. It it It's like that card in Slay the Spire, like the more you use it, the stronger it gets in that fight. But uh in the other direction obviously. So we're actually at Eden. gone poorly. I have no idea what was actually damaging me. That was really bad. Here, we'll get the rollerblades. We're gonna be permanently hasted at this point. I seriously don't know what was happening there. I think I was doing it to myself, but I can't be super sure. How is that thing not dead? Get it out of here. 
It's like a, it's almost like a self-defense turret, but not quite. Throw a cascading bomb that hits adjacent tiles four tiles away and gain one flow. Glitter bomb's pretty cool. Maybe take that. Hits four tiles away if you have fragile. Hits in a cross. Lose one max mana for 20 seconds. Mana cost is equal to your max mana. That's weird. Losing max mana is very strange. 25% chance to hit twice, but it's 10 damage 40 times. Possible 400 damage. But even though it does a lot of damage, I don't think it's quite worth it. Same with Glitter Bomb. It does a nice AoE effect, but I don't think it's powerful enough to fit my deck. I think we just heal the 250. You finally made it to Eden. Before you fight me, you should know that I make my own rules. Whoa! What the heck? Oh my gosh. Careful! Oh, there are no sides. There's literally the whole field. How did I manage to dodge every single one of those? Unreal, dude. Okay. That's a single shuffle. Oh god. I don't want you on this side. Ah! Oh, I can't believe I managed to hit that! You know, you can't kill me. What the heck? My duty is to protect Eden, but I guess it's a bit late for that. The only way is to turn everything back. Maybe you'll make better choices next time? What? Approaching fire? I'm in like tier 8. It keeps going! She healed me to full... ...and then gave me the runaround? But I can take wildfire again. I'm not taking wildfire again. Yo, we're gonna keep it going for as long as we humanly possibly can. Maybe I'll make better choices this time. You know what? I'm not super incentivized to, uh... Kill everybody this time, I guess. Yeah, you saved me. But I get more artifacts. Can't carry any more artifacts? Are you kidding me? Oh no. This is the disaster scenario. Why are you capping me on artifacts, man? It's not fair. I worked for all of these. Now if I just knew how to get rid of some of them. Randomly damages targets and pulls you pulls them towards you. So I can't have any more artifacts. And I don't think there's a way to get rid of them. Is there? Where's the flow stuff? I can't get rid of it. Didn't think so. I don't see why it would let me.
Hmm. Go on. Oh! That was no good. How do you have so much health that I can't kill you so easily? We're losing. We're losing faith. Shots heal target. No, I think I'm just gonna... Let's just try and rush to the end. Let's see what happens. Save everybody. Give me heals. Don't even kill the rabbit this time. I know it's gonna be a tough call. The amount of damage that we're able to do, and the shield that we're able to generate, I think... I think we're fine? I don't know, we're gonna end up fighting Celacy again. Calamity spells, have you seen any? Yeah, lady. I have like three. How do you have that much health? It's actually insane. I'm not gonna be able to get through this, I don't think. Oh, you know what? Never mind. Because... Oof. Get that shield, lady. Just die already, please. Alright, I'll let you live this time. You'll make it up to me. You know you better. Because this is going to be a harder run. Harder than we've ever anticipated. Ouch. If it dies immediately. I don't know if it's worth having in the deck anymore, to be honest. Might just have to get rid of it. Can't carry any more artifacts. Of course we can't. Ooh. Five mana. Double cast, though. Restores half mana. You know what? Restoring half mana is not so bad. Just means I can cast more in, a, in the future. Alright, you have frost on you, and I'm not sure exactly how that happened. Oh, that actually did do something. Okay. See, now we're just going through the motions. Deals 30 extra damage for each flame. No. We just need to go. We just need to go, go, go. I need to stop looking at the cards even, just like... Just need to move forward. <laughs> I think I- yeah, I'm just gonna get rid of that turret. It doesn't seem to be doing anything else anymore. Oh, slash all enemies for 99. Could be good. I don't like the blackout effect, though, so let's not use it. Plant a mine on a random enemy tile. Chance to leave a flame on hit. Restore half mana cost. You know what? Let's grab that. We're going to go ahead and also get rid of... What was it again? Lose two money. That's like chump change to me now. Uh, what was I going to get rid of? Turret. It's great earlier on, but... The further you get, it seems the less reliable it is, because it doesn't have nearly enough health to be able to just simply survive. I'm actually just looking at my spells more than I'm looking at the field at this point, and hoping that I uh, am able to survive. It looks like we came out ahead on that one. <laughs> 
Like, I'm not even focusing on dodging at this point. It's actually kind of ridiculous. Treasure chest is literally pointless. I can't do anything about... I can't do anything there. Uh, whoops, missed. Okay. Like, yeah, we're generating all the shield in the world. We got nothing to worry about. It's a long ace episode, my friends. And it's because we're in the eye of the tiger. Got the eye of the tiger. Unload, my friend. Oh, you're not allowed to do that. What the? I don't know where I was supposed to go there. Land somewhere, please. Ooh. All right, if you stand still, I'll give you a present. A really nice present. Hope you enjoyed that one. Ooh, she landed on the mine. I can stop you. We're getting all the achievements in the world by killing, or I mean, defeating all of these people. Let's see if, uh, let's see if Celacy is going to do anything for us. Or do anything to us, I should say. Okay, I'm going to end up accidentally killing all of the friendly, um, nurses and, and whatnot. Oh my god, I opened the boxes! Holy crap. Is this what the- is this what it's gonna be like? I think this is what it's gonna be like, and I don't like it. Okay, the thunderstorm I think is gonna be nice. Uh... I know I said I shouldn't even be looking at them. But it's hard not to. Dude. Uh, that's about 600 damage that I've taken, um, per fight. This isn't going very well. I can't carry any more artifacts on level up either. It's such a disappointment. Why can't you let me have more artifacts? Is it because you're afraid I'll get way too powerful? Because you're right. Uh, it wasn't right. That wasn't what I needed to do. That one didn't go terribly. We're still in the negative. But for now, things are moving. Now we have a mini boss, and that's actually frightening. Come on. Okay. <laughs> that was better. That was good. Things are getting tense. Okay, we got a nice minor heal. Taking a lot of hits. Those missile guys? Okay, these scorpion guys? These everything guys. Okay, okay, good. Everything is just- the, everything's firing everything. Summon three gun turrets? Oh my god. I mean, not worth it. But I didn't even know that existed. Ugh. 
This is gonna do a billion damage to me, I think. She has so much health. What the? What is happening? Time has slowed down so much that the game. Okay. Excuse me? Excuse me? I could not. I was rooted. I got hit by 50 million things at the same time. I don't even know. <laughs> I don't even know what I could have done there. Okay, so I guess this counts as a game, as a victory. We gained 13 levels in this. No, 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 we gained 13 levels in the game. No, we passed 13 levels in the game. Or something, I don't know what that even means. But we gained three levels or something, two levels, I don't know. Unlocking things, vaccine. You know, 160 HP. And gain 80 poison at the start of battle. That's very interesting. I mean, it's a net positive. Right? So 80, then 120, and 140, and 150. 150. It's, it's almost exactly even, actually. Hits enemies with 20 damage rainbows that remove a buff at the start of battle. That's kind of funny. Flechette. Weapon hits ricochet. And hit another enemy. Dude! That's amazing. Sidewinder fire and misled a random en enemy for each structure on the field. Oh, that's gonna make Hazel so much more fun. But, dude, I'm gonna count that as a victory. Uh, but it does. Okay, so here's the thing it seems like killing everybody, the genocide route, if you will is the quote-unquote easier route but it's not the true ending it's not the way to actually beat the game you beat the bot you beat the final boss but she just sends you back to the beginning but what happens if you go for a full mercy route if you do that and then you beat the boss then what happens we're gonna have to endeavor to find out and i think doing that on the shopkeeper is going to be one of the hardest things to do in the game Killing everybody makes everything super easy because you end up with so much money. But if you can uh, if you can manage to defeat that final boss without killing everybody and having enough money to have enough health to do what you need, then you might be in a good spot. I don't know. But this was a wild, wild experience. I hope you enjoyed this extra long episode. I don't know if we're gonna ever have anything this long again. I don't know if I ever want to do a genocide run again. Um, and I'm not sure. Actually, is there something different for neutral too? I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this episode. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.